Welcome to Chemistry Tutorial 360. Today we are going to find out the valence electrons of neon, right? So we'll find out the valence of valence electrons of neons in just three or four steps. So let's get started. So to find out the valence electrons of neon, we have to look at the periodic table. So if we look at the periodic table, then the symbol for neon is, uh, we get the symbol for neon is Ne and its atomic number is 10. This means that it has 10 proton and 10 electron. As you know that the charge of proton and electron is, <coughs> is same but opposite. So now we need to do the electronic configuration of neon and uh, to do electronic configuration for neon we'll we will use this uh, chart right so uh, s subshell can take maximum two electrons p subshell can take maximum six electrons d subshell can take maximum 10 electrons and f subshell can take maximum 14 electrons right so let me put the first two electron to s2 one s2 subshell then we have to place the second two electron here, then here 2p, 2p6, right? So we have 6 plus 2, 8 plus 2, 10. So we have taken here 10 electrons, right? So this is the electronic configuration of neon. Now we'll find out valence shell, right? valency shell valency shell so how to how to get valency shell so you know that principal quantum number is denoted by n so here the value of n is 1 then 2 right 2 to find out valency shell we will consider the highest value of n so we have to consider here 2 right so in 2 we are getting 2s2 2p6 this is the valency shell of neon right this is the valency shell of neon and the electrons of valency shells uh, valency shell are called valence electrons so 2 plus 6 that gives you 8 so neon uh, has 8 valency electrons out of 10 electrons right I have a special blog post uh, on the valence electrons of neon. You can read that blog post from the description box of this video. So thank you for viewing this video. Be well.